Now in these difficult times, you're out there looking for additional income streams, especially to do so online or from the comforts of your home. And as you're doing so, you're realizing that some of these online platforms require that you have a US bank account, not a US dollar bank account, but a bank account in the US in order for you to get paid. And you're sitting there thinking, but I'm not a US citizen, nor am I a resident. How am I gonna get an account in the US? I'm not gonna pay to fly to the US to just open a bank account. What do I need to have a bank account in the US? And all these thoughts are going through your head. Well, you know what? You are in the right place because with this video, I'm gonna tell you exactly how to open a bank account in the US without having to fly there while you sit wherever you are right now and not just getting you a bank account, but getting you an international US dollar debit card that you can use to buy from stores locally where you live or to shop online. Yes, you are indeed getting a two for one special today. You're gonna get the bank account in the US and you're gonna get a debit card, which is a MasterCard that can be used anywhere you go or even where you live today. Are you ready for this? I'm sure you are. It's time to stop limiting your ability to earn online because you don't have something as simple as a bank account in the US. Welcome back to my channel, my YouTube family, my rock stars. I feel like I need to say our channel because we're all in this together. So let me redo that. Welcome back to our channel, my YouTube family, my rock stars. If you're here for the first time, please hit the subscribe button so that we can welcome you to become a part of our amazing family here where we talk about financial freedom and how to get there. And we do so on Monday, Wednesdays, and Thursdays with a video being posted at 9 a.m. Now, a lot of times when I share solutions or options, the question is often asked, does this work in my country? So let me first cover all the countries where you can actually use the platform I'm about to share to open a bank account in the US. So take a look at the screen and let's go through that list here let me just turn on my screen record i'm gonna call out a few of them so we have albania algeria australia let me call out some of the non-conventional ones of course jamaica belize cameroon china chad denmark dominican republic ecuador let me go down here ghana i see many of you watching from ghana of course south africa i already said jamaica but jamaica and the list is very long. Niger, as you can see here, Senegal, Saudi Arabia, Turks and Caicos Island. So there's very, very few countries, if any, where you cannot open a bank account in the US using what I'm about to share with you. So that said, let's jump right into it. Please check the description below at the top. I'm gonna share the link that you should click to open your bank account in the US. So let's get to that platform right now and I'll take you through step by step exactly what you need to do. First, we're gonna open your US bank account or let me rephrase that, your bank account in the US because you know you can have a US bank account in your local country. That's not what we're saying. So first, we're gonna explain how to open your bank account in the US. Second, I'm gonna show you how to get your international master debit card. Third, I'm gonna show you how to activate your debit card. And then last, I'm gonna show you, now that you have created your bank account in the US, exactly how to withdraw money from it so that if you want to have access to that money in your local bank account, you can do so or you can do so by using that card, that debit card, which I'm gonna show you how to get, and you can use it locally to withdraw funds at ATM machines. You can do so in US dollars, if it's an ATM that distributes in US currency or in your local currency, or you can use it for point of sale, which is to buy from stores in person or online. 
now before we dive in i have a special giveaway for you and i have already given away what i've earned or most of what i've earned from my last youtube check so now or payment i should say so now i'm actually giving away money that i haven't even earned yet because as you guys know one of the reasons for this channel is to give back some of what i'm earning to you and to charity so today we're gonna give away a hundred us dollars here is who can get it if you saw your country that you're watching from in the list that i shared i want you to write your country name in the comments and we will go in and select randomly one person and whenever that one person that we select opens their account using the link in the description we're gonna transfer a hundred us dollars to the account so you get your first deposit as a gift so what we're gonna do is we're gonna browse through all the comments we're gonna do a random selection of who the winner is and then we're gonna put a note below your comment that you are the winner the minute you open your account using the link in the description we will transfer that $100 to you so you can kickstart your account on a good note now let's open your bank account in the US Click the link in the description below and when you get to that link, you will see some of the partners that this company has worked with to provide financial payments or to manage their business. But where I want you to go is to click on sign up and earn $25. By clicking this link specifically that I'm sharing, whenever your bank balance gets to a certain amount, you will start earning rewards. And one of those rewards is $25. US So click sign up and earn $25 and it will take you to the next screen. I know you should know that the platform where we're gonna open this bank account is Payoneer. And Payoneer is a platform that facilitates business owners or individuals to conduct business with either customers in the US or suppliers or to receive payment from buyers or for work done when you are doing it on a platform that requires you to have a US bank account or a bank account I should say in the US. I keep confusing those two terms. It's the latter. So after clicking sign up and earn $25, you select individual unless you're creating a business profile or a business bank account. Now after you select individual, you'll need to fill in your personal details which you know better than I, right? Now during the application process, you will be asked to enter your banking information and this is the banking details for where you bank locally where you live your bank country, your bank account type, whether checking or savings, the currency that you want to receive your money in, which for me, I selected US dollars, the name of your bank and your bank account number. So just make sure you have that on hand when you're about to put in the information. If it does require you to enter a SWIFT code or a wire transfer code, for me, I just Google First Caribbean SWIFT code and I get it for whichever branch I want it for. You may be able to do that with your bank as well. If not, just reach out to your bank and ask them for their wire transfer instructions and you'll be able to pull from it what you need to open your bank account in the US. Now, at the end of this process, your bank account would have been created. There is an approval process that takes very little time and it applies for some countries and then you'll get the approval and now you have a bank account in the US so just share your banking details now with whichever online platform where you could not get paid without having a bank account in the US or you can use it to transact business as you see fit with customers in the US who are trying to buy from you who only want to pay to a US bank with your bank account now set up with Payoneer you'll be able to not just receive 
deposits or receive payments or for persons to buy and send the money to you but you can also pay money from it transfer money wire money it works exactly the same like your regular bank account so you will get your own wire transfer instructions for your new bank account that you can use to receive funds from others as you see fit say what so now that you have your bank account in the US, now it's time to get you your international debit mastercard why do i use the word international because you can use it from anywhere in the world to not just buy from merchants or in stores or online but also to withdraw cash and you can withdraw cash in your local currency or in us dollars if that's the currency you choose to receive money in now your master debit card can either be physical or it can be digital what do i mean by that you can actually get a physical debit card that you can use when you walk into a store to swipe or to tap or you can use that physical card to input your details to buy online or you can get a digital card which is a, basically an email or a, it looks like a, a card but it's digital with your card number, your expiration date, of course your name and your PIN so that you can use it to buy online or to transact business online. Now I have the virtual card because I mostly do business online so whether it's paying my utility bills or buying stuff online or paying for goods and services for the business so I didn't need to receive a physical card because I don't really need to withdraw money at an ATM or to swipe it at a point of sale to buy goods and services in a store I have other cards to do that like my credit card so I chose the digital version if you want to be able to walk into an ATM and withdraw cash you need the physical card if you want to walk into a store as I said earlier and swipe it you do need the physical card so it's up to you whichever card type you choose the information required is the same now when you apply for a digital card you will get it almost immediately when you apply for a physical card it will take about two to four weeks for you to get it in the mail if five weeks go by and you still have not received your card reach out to Payoneer's customer care and ask them for assistance in tracking your card so now that you are an account holder you just sign in and start the application for your MasterCard select settings and then go to Payoneer cards and then you click on order a card select the type of card whether physical or virtual as I explained earlier and select the currency that you want to be paid in. For example, if you want to be paid in US from Payoneer as they receive funds, then that's the currency that you should select. Follow the other instructions on the page and voila, now you have your Payoneer Master Debit Card. Now let me put a very important caveat in there. You will not be able to apply for your Payoneer Debit MasterCard until you have at least a hundred US dollars in your account. Again, whenever you create your bank account as I shared earlier and your balance grows to a hundred US dollars, you can then apply for your debit card. Now that's exactly why I've decided to give the lucky winner a hundred dollars so you can draw down on your money the minute you get that hundred dollars in your account. Now like any other bank account you will be able to track your bank balance at any one point in time and you'll be able to determine how much you have access to when you have your card based on your bank balance. Now to activate your card, it's very simple. Just log into your Payoneer account and follow the instructions to activate your card and you'll be able to do so right there in that session and your card will be usable thereafter. So now that you have your bank account in the US created, now you need to figure out how to withdraw funds and get it to your local bank account if you want to do that as opposed to using the MasterCard to pull money and having cash on hand. So let's say you're making large sums of money 
from wherever you're making it from and it's accumulating in your bank account in the US and you want to pull down on that money and have it available in your local bank account all you have to do is to log into your Payoneer account and click withdraw when you click on withdraw you're gonna immediately see the banking details there you remember those banking details that you had entered when you were opening your account initially those details will be there and you can just select that if that's the bank that you want to receive your money from Payoneer with if you want to use another bank you'll just need to select bank account and then you can enter the details and choose that as your bank account to be used for withdrawing money from your bank account in the US with Payoneer. The good thing is after you have entered your banking details once it will populate whenever you're ready to make a withdrawal you just need to choose which bank account if you have many that you want to use to receive this withdrawal. You then need to select the amount that you want to withdraw and follow the steps and that's it. Your money will be transferred to your account over a few days. Payoneer has their standard management fees to maintain your account but it's not anything unusual when compared to a typical bank. So that's it my YouTube family. You have just now created your bank account in the US so there's no more reasons why you can't receive payments from those online payment platforms or for providing services overseas that demand that you have a bank account located in the US. You have now solved that problem and on top of that you now have a MasterCard that you can use to withdraw US dollars or money in your local currency or to use to buy online or for point of sale transactions and you are able now to manage your money and get access to it very readily. If you found value in this video and learned something that you didn't know before I would really appreciate you clicking the like button. Until next time my YouTube family what good?